What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, by popular demand, we'll be continuing a theme of molecular gastronomy. And the topic of today's video is transparent ravioli. We will make our delicious ravioli filled with parsley puree and serve it with caramelized cherry tomatoes, vegan feta cheese and some mint. Before we proceed though, please take a moment to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to like it and put some comments below. Okay, let's move on. So the first thing that we are going to do is to put our tray in the freezer. Next, parsnip puree. While the parsnip is getting cooked, let's quickly start caramelization of our beautiful cherry tomatoes. So our filling is done, our garnish is done, now it's time to proceed and make transparent dough. For our transparent dough we will need water, vegetable broth for flavor, agar agar and xanthan gum. By the way, make sure that you use blender for this recipe. You won't be able to mix those ingredients as well by hand. So once it's all mixed, transfer it to a small to medium pot and bring it to boil while whisking. Now, when you brought the mixture to boil and activated agar agar, now we need to pass it through the strainer with some uh, cheesecloth to eliminate the bubbles. Now, it's time to take out our ice cold tray from the freezer, put it on your workstation and spread our mixture evenly. Discard the extras. And let it cool down at room temperature or you can also put it in the fridge, it will cool down faster. Okay guys, this is it. Our transparent ravioli are ready and I'm gonna taste them in a minute. 
The plate in itself looks uh, simple, but I think it's very beautiful. Okay, let me taste it out. I'm gonna start with a small one. They are very, very fragile, so... Hmm, hmm. It's really good, but I have to say, you really need to focus here on the garnish and um, feeling of uh, ravioli because the transparent dough, it doesn't really taste like anything. It tastes like water if you've done it with water or like um, vegetable broth like I did. But overall, the concept is really interesting. So try it out and let me know in the comments what are your ideas for this concept. Okay, that's it for today, guys. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.